nice to see you. Hope you had a, a really nice weekend and you're ready for another week of home learning. We're nearly there, week and a half to go to the summer holidays. Um, we know you're getting a bit sleepy and a bit tired, but you're doing a really great job. Thank you for sending the work in that you sent last week. We've really enjoyed seeing that. And this week we have a few different things for you. So I'm going to hand over to Mrs Carlton first, who's going to tell you about maths and English this week. Hello, Year 4. Uh, I'm just going to tell you a little bit about English. Now, normally Mrs Harding tells you about that, but as you can see, she's not able to be with us this morning. Um, she has set you some English on haiku poems, which you've actually done some of before, at the beginning of uh, our lockdown period. So you're going to be looking at some different haikus and then by the end of the week, writing your own haiku poem. Um, so hopefully that'll be quite a nice activity to sort of wind down as we get nearer our summer break. Moving on to maths, we're looking at coordinates this week. Uh, our, so today, Monday, we're looking at um, the x and the y axis and reminding ourselves of what coordinates are and how to plot points on uh, a coordinates grid. Uh, and then Tuesday, Wednesday, that's looking at drawing different types of shapes on coordinates grids. So it's a bit of revision on your different types of triangles, as well as revision of acute and obtuse angles. And then at the end of the week on Thursday and Friday, you're looking at translation of shapes on a coordinates grid. And that's a little bit trickier because it's moving a shape from one part of the grid to another. So maybe moving it several squares right and then several squares up or several squares down and then sometimes moving the shape backwards, which is a bit trickier. And you might end up moving a shape um, into the negative numbers as well. So. Like I say, don't worry if you find it a little bit tricky. There's some of the tasks, some of the tar starter tasks are also a little bit difficult uh, this week, but just do the best that you can. Uh, and I always think that shape's quite a nice topic as well. So hopefully, uh, again, it's another way to, uh, to sort of wind down and have a change from number. Uh, moving on to Mrs Southgate. Hi, um, Year 4 and Arc 4. Uh, this week you're going to be looking at Aladdin. Aladdin's your story to finish off the term. Um, you're going to do things on the desert, you're going to explore travelling on a magical carpet. So you're going to have great fun doing that. And then um, hopefully if the sun stays out, we will get outside and uh, you can get outside and have some fun in the garden or the park. Um, take care and I'll see you soon. Over to Mr Barnard. Thank you very much. So um, the rest of your subjects this week, we've got some nice things planned for you. Um, you'll notice Mrs. Roma's not here today. She couldn't make it uh, this morning either, but she says hello. Um, and um, so for science this week, you're going to be thinking about food chains and coming up with a food chain of your own. And there's a game to help you to understand that and have some fun with as well. For computing, you're going to be looking at online safety. It's a really important thing, isn't it, to have to, to remind ourselves about online safety. And there's some games and activities to help you with that. And a little quiz, I think, as well, to help you with that as well, so to keep you safe online. Other activities we've got planned for you are around thinking about our moving up to year five. Very exciting time, isn't it? And I know lots of you are coming in for our move up days this week and next week, and you'll have been told which one you've been allocated to. Um, so there's a few activities to help you think about that in advance of coming in for your move up day. And um, just to say on move up days, we're very excited that you're all coming back. We're really looking forward to seeing everybody and seeing you all again. And uh, what we'll do is you will get a chance to say goodbye to us during that day as well when you're with your, your teacher for year five. So we're looking forward to seeing you then. So the other thing to point out to you is if you haven't found it already, if you go on our school website to the Our Schools section and click on the link, the top thing on the menu that says transition for, 20, for September 2020, if you go onto that page, there's lots of details about how our move up days are going to work. And also there's a really nice video that Miss Colin and our new head of school, Mr Lowe's, have recorded where he's answering lots of children's questions and it's a chance for children to get to know him a little bit. It's a really nice video and I would really recommend you watch it um, so that you start to get to know Mr Lowe's as well. So that's your week coming up. I hope you have a fantastic week and uh, we will look forward to seeing you on, on your move up days and we will speak to you soon. Bye.